President Trump is heading to Kenosha, Wisconsin today. Again, if you're a Wisconsin view, uh, uh, person, please write us in on Facebook and YouTube. We'd love to hear. What do you call from, that? A Wisconsin in? I don't know. A Wisconsin -ite. A Wisconsinite? Wisconsinite. Well, there it's like go. a semi-precious gemstone. All right. Well, okay. let's hope so. Is it diamond? No, it's Wisconsinite. But there are a <laughs> lot of mixed feelings about his visit. Local officials, including the governor of Wisconsin and the mayor of Kenosha, are concerned it could make tensions worse. There was some talk the president was going to meet with Jacob Blake's family. Jacob Blake, if you don't know, was shot seven times in the back by police. But now that is not happening. Instead, the president will tour some of the damage in Kenosha from the unrest and will also meet with law enforcement. Some are saying his visit is only politicizing the situation while failing to address the issue of police accountability. But others welcome his visit and hope it will bring an end to protests and violence. We're going we're gonna to continue the story here. We're going to follow it. We're going to let you know how that visit goes and if it helps to calm a community on edge. Jeff, what are your thoughts quickly on this? Um, I think that was that script was written beautifully, right? It showed both sides because that's where we're at in this country. Unfortunately, the world is split and you're right. If you look at that and you heard something you liked, you're right. And if you looked at it and you heard something that you didn't like, you're right too, because it showed both sides. I think this country, Tori, we're going to see what happens at the end of today. I hope it's peaceful. I hope there's not more problems than we started the day with. But I think what we need to do as a country is really have a conversation, a real, honest conversation, which is what we try to do here. Yeah. But I think we need to try to do it as a country. You're not going to change the far left. You're not going to change the far right. It's that group in mm -hmm. between. Mm -hmm. If we could have a conversation, you know, and get some hard conversations out there. I, I know it's difficult, you know, and not through social media. I'm talking real conversations. I think that's the answer. But again, nobody has the answer, Tori. You know, it's a difficult does. time. It really is. And all I can say is right now, vote, vote, vote. Get out there and use your voice.